Next is 418 trade winds. The house with the uh, ivy growing on it. This one is interesting. The last one that I was at across the street was not interesting. I didn't video that. There were people in residence. I'll send you a report. This one's a little bit smaller, but it's much more functionally laid out. Here's the entry. It's an older house that has been renovated. I'm standing at the front door. Master's in that direction. And there's a guest room immediately to the left of me. Ceilings have a little bit of height to them, a little bit of character. Formal dining room here at the front of the house. You can see the family room in there, and there's a bedroom back, back in that corner. First, we'll come straight ahead and do a left turn. Takes us into the guest bedroom. There's a bathroom or a closet here that's locked. Bedroom is normal sized. Uh, queen size bed would be max. You could get in here comfortably. Good closet space. Good ceiling height. Blue. Floors are tile on the square, not on the diagonal, but they're a nice large tile. There's this room here. That's a, just a linen closet. And you see you got nice wood trim around everything. We'll come into here. You got a big four poster bed in here. Tall ceilings. It's furniture. Large walk in closet back here. And you'll see the Sliders to the lanai. Southern exposure. We'll go back to the deck in a minute. Nice little work again. The bathroom is all renovated. Nice tile. Jacuzzi tub. This is like the before and after compared to that other house I was at across the street. This being the after and that one being the disaster. Not disaster, but just not good. You wouldn't like it at all. This one's got some character. Plus the southern facing. Both of them incidentally are owned by realtors. There's the front door. And then this would be living room. Quite large. That's the entrance to the kitchen and the family room. I'm going to go around the long way. Give you a feel for it. Going past the pool, these doors all open up. There's a second dining area here, a smaller one for the dinette, if you will. Granite countertops to the kitchen, the pass through to this little dinette area. It's a nice floor plan. And you've got the family room in here. Again, you've got peaked ceilings in here. Good colors. Again, look at the wood trim everywhere. Kitchen with newer appliances, stove top. This is open to the ceiling here. I think you would like this house. This is to the garage. There's steps down to the garage. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven or eight steps down to the garage level. Two car garage. I don't think the MG comes with it. There's storage on both sides. There's, it would be hard to get two cars in here if there were big cars with all the storage that's used. You may have to lose the storage on one side. Okay.